back. Hey, the good boy. Alright, son. Good lad. <sighs> Hello. We're out in the woods. Mm. Alright, son. I know. I love you. We're out in the woods again today. Got a new wood burning stove to try out. Uh, I'll put the link as normal below from Amazon 2399 I think it was I uh, can't remember the exact name of it now but uh, we'll get started and we'll have a quick look a bit mad on how much water but just to show you how much one scoop gets <coughs> yeah. right so this is it all in this it comes in it's stainless steel and it comes in at 760 grams. So I have tried this out yesterday. So uh, let's see. If I did try this out. Oh, look, I managed to do the sun again. In just in the garden. I mean, I'm cheating a bit today. I've brought some fire starters. Well, they come out. I have uh, brought some fire starters. But basically, that's it. I'm sure you've all seen all these fire boxes go together, this it just falls out and on the inside we've got the ashtray that has a little griddle or a little seat thing that sits on it, we've got lugs in the end there which just go over and a grill for the top, so as quick as that, that's it, in its shape point it down. I don't know how far down it are there, but uh, yeah you can have it at different heights if you were to put a like a transi burner on it or something so but that's that's basically it together no time at all where is it there. So that's it together. That's where you'll feed your coals. And that just pops on the top as you as you grill. So right, I'll get this uh, I'll turn the camera around. <laughs> so there it is, set up. As I say, all you do is feed you. Feed your wood into the front of it there. Nice, right, get it on the go. I've brought some sausages and some mushrooms. And there we go, with the kindling on. You see these, I'm in the woods and there's plenty of woods, but there's been a bit of rain, so it's probably a bit damp. Come out, Ollie. It's the only thing when I bring him, he can be a nuisance. He's normally pretty good. Well, that's caught lovely, so yeah, let's get some sausages on. We've actually decided to put a pot of water on first, so I brought this little tray with us, just a little bacon tray to stand it on. I will uh, douse all the ground down with me gallon of water that's over there when we're done. But, uh, there's a brew on it. I know when I did it in the garden yesterday. I mean, I'd filled that to sort of 500 mil, uh, and it only took literally two or three minutes, and it was a proper blow the top off the uh, thing, which it will do with fire like that. And the ventilation.
There we go, some real wood in it. That water's about boiled now. A couple of minutes. You see, you never, I don't people timing it, because if you're out just enjoying the countryside, it's not really anything to rush for. Especially if we're night, <laughs> you've time on your hands. No mad rush, just nice to watch a fire sometimes. I don't know what you think, but that's my thoughts. And there's our sausages on now. Well, more ollies really, to be honest, than mine. Getting a little sizzle on one side, so tea bag tongs. Could be possibly a bit burnt, couldn't it? Because I didn't bring any, I didn't bring any oil with me. And it's probably a bit hot for them. <laughs> Never mind. Not a bad place to sit. Is it all? Oh. <laughs> Bless him. It's so easy to load this with twigs and well bigger bits of my twig bear now obviously but you know just a, a metre long sort of dead branch broken up is uh, just keeps it ticking over. They're about done I think. <laughs> like, just keep them going a bit longer and then I'll have one and only will have a couple. I had some mushrooms to use up. <laughs> I think I've got, I might have gone overboard. And it's only a little pan. There's my hand to give you size scale. Yeah, yeah. smash. Very impressed with this little stove so far. So you know, it's warm by, warm by this fire. There, I've cooked down them mushrooms. Just done it. Simmer then now. Well, he's having his sausages. Go on then. Yeah. It's because he ate one before and it was too hot for him, so now he's panicking. Oh, Ollie. Chasing his sausage. <laughs> Gotta stop with all these double entendres. Yeah, it. Want another one? See ya. It's cool, Ollie. <laughs> I can feel it's not even hot anymore. <laughs> Good lad. <laughs> Dad's boy. Well, that's it from me and Ollie. Uh, we've all packed up. I didn't show you packing away the, the stove. It just falls in on itself and same as it comes apart, you know, just goes in and folds itself back in the bag. That's where we were, just down this little track. So as always, leave no trace. Um, I ordered a little bit at the end, but there was a girl come through with a few dogs. Uh, and Ollie, 90% of the time, he's all right. It was just that 10%. If he takes a dislike, and he can be a bit of a bugger. So I couldn't film and keep my eyes on Ollie and everything at the same time. So. Uh, that's why. Anyway, uh, if you've liked the video, please give us a thumbs up. It does help. Subscribe if you wish. And hopefully going to be out camping on the weekend. So uh, that'll be the next upload at some point next week. So thanks very much for watching. If you've already subscribed, once again, thank you ever so much. So that's it from me and the dog. Bye for now.